Alrighty, so let's look at the tomatoes today. I'm going to show you how all my tomato plants are doing. So this is, I've got five in this raised garden bed. So here, you can see we've got some tomatoes growing, uh, lots of flowers. I have no idea what this variety is yet because it was a random one I just transplanted to here. And uh, it pruned a little bit. I need, I need to take this off. It's getting close to the soil. But I do, because this is a, well, I don't know. I'm guessing it's probably a determinant because it, it would have come from something I've grown last season. So being a determinant, I keep most of the suckers. But, oh, I'm going to be... I'm very curious to see what it is. It could be a pink egg tie. Could be, it's hard to tell yet. There's more under there. It's doing well. Then we've got a tomato moneymaker doing well. We've had quite strong wind recently, so I've just tied these up to a stake. When I say these, I'm talking about the other ones that I'll show you. So this I grew from seed and what is it like? I don't know, nearly probably six weeks roughly. So it's looking pretty good so far. I'm quite happy with it. Then over here, and the four I've grown from seed, they're all about six weeks old. Uh, I planted them late winter. And this is a Japanese tomato plant. Now, uh, I've not grown them before, and it's very interesting so far because it looks like doesn't look like any tomato plant that I've grown before. Like the leaves look totally different. Like you look at this one; they they all have this look about them. You know, they've got that look. This one's very interesting. So I'm curious to see what it looks like. Uh, I, I think from memory, the tomatoes can be black. Uh, we'll go over here to look at my other tomato plant. This is doing quite well, actually. It's all planted at the same time. All, all, I sowed these all. I can't remember how long before the seeds popped up. Could have been 10 days. I'm not sure, but this is a Roma looking, looking very nice. And we'll take a walk this way. I need to change the spelling of that. That's supposed to be an S, but I have a feeling it was written on the packet like this, and I wasn't thinking. This could be a different way that it's spelled, but it's supposed to be an S. A cerise, a cerise tomato, looking, looking quite happy as well. So those are the four that I've grown from seed, and then this original one. Then we'll go this way. This is doing very well. Ow, just pulling a bindi out of my foot. So this good sized tomato plant here, this is one that I transplanted from the garden. So I have no idea what it was. It was, would have been, you know, seeds from one of the tomato plants I grew last season, probably, but I really don't know what it is. But it looks fine. Very thick. Lots and lots and lots of tomatoes growing. It's doing really well. And I'm going to give it some food this week. I'm going to give it some specific tomato food granules. And I will probably also just add some slow release and a bit of uh, blood and bone or something. So with this, I've packed it. Word. I've pruned it back here to here and taken off the lower suckers. As you can see, for those who don't know what a sucker is, it's got a main stem and the, the sun leaf or the whatever you sometimes I call it a sun leaf because it stretches out and like these and this doesn't matter. But it's what in between. So I've cut those, but the rest at this point I have left because this plant is a determinant. And because it's a determinant, um, look, it may grow to two meters, it may grow to uh, 
um, whatever. I like. I still don't know what type it is, but just because I don't know what type it is doesn't mean I don't know it's a determinant because it's definitely come from a garden bed where I grew last year some different types and they were all determinants. So this way I like to let the suckers grow about a third of the way up. Um, look, you could just keep two to four suckers, but I like to let it go thick. Another tomato plant, I don't know what it is. Another one, another tomato, another tomato, just for like transplant. Here's another one of those random tomatoes that I just put here. 